Well, it's just another day at the office for Marcus Willis, isn't it? The world number 772 knocking up for a match with, oh yeah, just Roger Federer. There he is down at Orangi. He's been interacting with the crowd who are gathered just above him there. He's uh, knocking up with his mate, Matt Smith, who we're hoping to grab a word or two with a little bit later on. But what a day and what an occasion this is for Marcus Willis after beating Ricardo Barankis. He has captured the public's imagination. And uh, I'm not sure if you can just hear the little ripple of crowd applause. It's because a certain Roger Federer has arrived. And uh, Marcus Willis has taken no notice of the seven-time Wimbledon champion whatsoever. He's just knocking up over there. And he does look as though he's enjoying today. He's been smiling and interacting with the crowd behind him, as he was doing in the match on Court 17 against Barankis. It's just the most wonderful tale, and it really has got people thinking that anything's possible here at Wimbledon. Uh, he's got a, an amazing Grand Slam record, if he wants to think of it from a positive perspective. Played one, won one. So uh, he's, he's on 100% at the moment. He's never lost to Roger Federer, because he's never played him. But uh, just amazing. He'll be third up on centre court. All the players were hoping to have been knocking up here at Orangi uh, for the last couple of hours, but we've had the rain covers on and off. But uh, it's overcast at the moment, but there is no rain falling right now. And there'll be so many people hoping that Willis really enjoys this occasion and this day, but that he doesn't spend too long looking at his surroundings because of course if he does that he could find himself a set and a breakdown within 15 or 20 minutes against Roger Federer but great player to watch he produced some unbelievable strokes let's not forget he saved 19 break points uh, against Barankis it was an absolutely sensational performance and there he is having dropped 30 kilos in the last two years he called himself Fat Boy and he decided to get fit. We're not sure whether his girlfriend Jenny, who was the one who persuaded him to postpone taking the coaching job and concentrate on tennis again, we're not sure whether she's going to be here today, but we're certainly expecting many of his uh, vociferous friends from uh, back home in Berkshire and from Loughborough University to be in attendance. And uh, in fact, there was a really nice moment. Uh, Grigor Dimitrov stopped him up here at Orangi. It really is a fantastic place to come and watch the players knocking up. Just around about where we're standing here, as he was preparing to go down, Grigor Dimitrov gave him a hug and said, just enjoy it, mate. Have a fantastic time. So you do get the feeling down here that a lot of the other players are really hoping that, that it's a great occasion for Marcus Willis. They've got huge respect for the fact that he's now won seven matches. Remember, seven matches arriving here at Wimbledon takes you to the final and takes you to the title, but not if you've come through pre-qualifying and qualifying. Just the most amazing story. And there he is, Jeff. Get back to the main man. Forget about me. Just absolutely superb. He's dropped the weight. He's produced the most amazing performance in his career so far. Can he do something very, very, very special here? Well, the crowd will be hoping so. He'll get an absolutely amazing reception on centre court. Marcus Willis on the biggest day of his life so far, and he's strolling around here at Orangi as if he's not got a care in the world. What a story and what a day it's going to be for the world number 772.